today i am in front of the royal delft porcelain factory the royal delft porcelain factory is in delft not in sri lanka but in holland the royal porcelain delft factory is renowned for the produce production of royal porcelain which is mostly blue and white as you can see here these are some of the samples of this factory uh, i will give you a short uh, historical introduction to the delft blue uh, porcelain uh, the chinese were the pioneers of uh, in pioneers in producing porcelain in the 12th in the in the year 1000 thousand and hundred and thousand two hundred but uh, during the colonial time in the 16 hundreds the Dutch uh, invades the whole world and they took it over from the Chinese so we can see this deaf blau deaf blue porcelain in different uh, entities where they took over the porcelain production from China and uh, in this city Delft they had a number of factories which produced this Delft blue porcelain so from 1653 we see that the start of porcelain in Holland in Delft and uh, day of today today, today this is, a, this is actually a porcelain in the shape of an apple. Here we can see uh, how the traditional handmade pottery is being made. Uh, the designer is uh, doing her work. And you can also see the uh, paintings. The paintings which are the scripts here. So basically I wanted to show that uh, when the designs are being made, usually it is in black color. After the design has completed the designs, it will go to the oven. It will go to the oven. And after keeping it for a few hours and heating it up to 100,200 Celsius, it became it becomes blue like this. Basically, I can show you an example. It starts from white. If you get the shape of the pot and it turns into black, where the design has been made. And after that, after the oven process, it becomes blue. This is a artwork by the famous artist Vermeer this is actually a building in Delft so this building has been converted into a royal Delft blue tile work through this artwork mm -hmm. on the left side we see the king of Holland and there, these are some exquisite artwork, exquisite uh, deaf blue work which has been done in the recent past.
and this is a collection of kings and queens in the Netherlands dedicated to their birthdays also done by Delft Blue this is the mother of the king of the Netherlands she was the previous queen Queen Beatrix and her mother Queen Juliana all in commemoration of the royalties and the present king King Willem Alexander all the day of blue recogni- recognizing the royalties the the prince the king and his wife queen at their wedding ceremony in commemoration of their wedding the delft blue porcelain has made exquisite works the other side of what i showed you now and queen beatrix the ex queen of the netherlands this is called the nachtwacht this is the most famous artwork in the netherlands the nachtwacht from uh, vincent van gogh and this is converted now with 430 tiles into an exquisite artwork of uh, delft blue porcelain this has never become so big in the world like this nachtwacht is a 1700 artwork where people are waiting for the war signals and this is another exquisite artwork again made out of tiles and in this uh uh section we see for christmas for every christmas what they have uh, produced Uh, every year for example this is 1925 for christmas they produced this uh, plate this is for 1930 for christmas so for every year what they produced can be seen here all with their blue royal royal their blue tile work and we also see that the day of blue is not only blue as you see it's also can be produced in black or day of blue can also be produced in different colors like green so when you are visiting holland do not forget to visit delft delft is pro- very popular world famous for the royal delft blue porcelain so i am in this factory i am in this place where from this from 1653 it has been all about exquisite tile work taken over from the chinese who were pioneers in this field now taken over from the dutch 